I think this is the last one. Oh. <laughs> all the bones. This is the clearing. With all the bones. Man. Yeah, happy Sunday to you, Sophie. <laughs> so sap. An old man came to the forest every day to drink sap from the trees. What does that taste like? Maybe honey. Tastes like honey. <laughs> uh to get there, the old man had to step around many dangerous traps. The villagers believed this old man had hidden a jade amulet in the forest, but the old man wanted the villagers to believe this because then they would search the forest for treasure and not drink his sap. So one cool fall night, someone set fire to the forest and the fire spread to the village. The old man escaped the fire by covering himself in sap. When he returned to the village, he found all the villagers' bones. The old man sat down and cried. Then he found more sap to drink. Okay. <laughs> what a story. And by covering himself in sap, he... Wait, okay, this is a bit illogical. <laughs> hmm... My experience in other casual games, casual hidden object adventure games, told me this is illogical because we always use sap like some kind of fuel. You use it around torches, to light the torches. <laughs> and also, uh, use sap to light fires, right? So, how he escaped the fire by covering himself in sap is impossible. <laughs> what is going on here? Hmm. Oh, and a drawing. I told you, you can't be here. But, Gramp, I wrote something for you. That's real nice. Thank you. Just, just leave it. I'll read it later. Okay, music. Hey, Jasmine. Nice seeing you here. One dead in Hell's Fire, Bayfield County, five damaged. A historic home of Red Creek Valley, Wednesday morning. According to officials from the Bayfield County Fire Department, the family of six was asleep when the blaze broke out in the, at the remote house, once owned by Albert Vandegrave, a 46-old Ogden Road in Red Creek Valley. Gail Carter, a 58, was pronounced dead at the scene. Remaining family members, was, family members were able to escape. Carter's husband, Edwin, 62, told investigators he may have been fallen asleep with a lit cigarette in his hand, and firefighters were dispatched to the scene at 1.22 a.m. and remained at the scene until around 5 a.m. Wednesday. They returned to the property four hours later to extinguish hot spots, which had rekindled. Hmm. So Gail Carter is a grandma. Grandma died in the fire and the grandpa followed, followed her. <laughs> yeah, died the same way. Okay, now I guess we're going back to. Uh, going back to the portal. Ah, we completed all the stories now, so. So now what? Christ, Ethan, you're in here again? You missed dinner. Mom and Dad are pissed. They've been looking all over the place. Get out of here, Travis. Leave me alone. <laughs> Wait. Hey, Ma, he's in here. The brother hasn't died yet in the game. Correct? 
Honey, be careful with that lamp. Dale, what the hell's wrong with your kid? Painting on walls, writing his stories. <laughs> I mean, what the fuck? Ethan! For God's sake, you missed dinner! I'm sorry. I've been working on a story all day. How long have I been out here? The adventures of Paul Prospero, supernatural detective. Where do you get this stuff? Pop, would you get Travis out of here, please? He draws pictures on walls. What the hell is that? Chad, shut up. You got yourself a faggot for a son, Dale. Travis, let's go. Come on. Faggot! Ethan, you're a fucking faggot! Travis, stop it! <laughs> oh, shit! Shit! Everyone! Whoa! Get out! Get out! The smoke, it's toxic! Oh, Jesus. Oh, God! What do we do? What do we do? Oh no. <coughs> but he didn't die in this fire. We saw him later on. So how did he escape? How did he escape from this smoke and fire? I don't get it. I don't understand. I wrote about you, but I don't know if I created you. You made me real. I can't go yet. I have to finish my story about you. I wrote stories about everyone. I know you did, but my story's done, and it's a fine story. I can let go? You can let go. What happens then? Another story, kid. What else? So, it was all a story, it was only a story. So what happened to everyone else? They all escaped? Man, I don't like this now. Everyone else is alive. Well, at least they are trying to put out the fire, but uh, are we too late? And Uncle, they're doing nothing. <laughs> okay, who caught fire there? Is that the father? Wow. Man, so all those murder scenes, they didn't happen at all. <laughs> it was all in the book, all in the story that Ethan Carter wrote himself. So all in his mind. And I am one of his characters. <laughs> I don't exist. We don't exist. Wow, the song. Wow, the soundtrack is one of the best that I've ever heard. <laughs> the soundtrack of this game.
Well, do we know he died or not? Maybe they saved him in time. <laughs> Maybe they got him out before he died. Before he suffocated. Yeah, I hope they got him out in time. Yeah, we are from all over the world, <laughs> all different time zones. Yeah, amazing game. It's one of its kind. I enjoyed it from start to finish, even though there are a few parts in the game that annoyed me. Like that portal house, and also the underground mines. <laughs> yeah, but I enjoyed it. It's amazing. Yeah, the graphics, the sceneries, the music, the voice acting. All exceptional.